Hi, I'm Molly Miller, and here's the rest of my story. came to be. I know that we had this chest full of CDs that I would rummage through and that opened me up to Ella Fitzgerald and Louis Armstrong and Rosemary Clooney and that was sort of my entree into the music. We were much too young. study and the work that I did in high school and college and outside of school, you learn a lot about leadership and a lot about collaboration and how those two things need to work in harmony. It teaches you how to command a bandstand, either in a rehearsal or on stage. gives you the wherewithal to understand your surroundings and understand that in any situation you are in a performance environment even if you're just having a one-on-one -on -one conversation with someone a lot of things are happening on the fly and you need to be really intuitive and pay attention to how the band is feeling you need to have that person that can give clear but subtle direction so that the audience isn't aware that there's any orchestration happening. They just think it's this spontaneous experience when it is, it is that, but it is also led by someone. That's definitely a skill that you craft through being a band leader. Music means Expression, presence, poise, creation, collaboration, and improvisation. And it's the interplay between all of those elements. You cannot be a great performer and only have presence, or only be creative, or only be technically proficient. So it's building a lot of bigger skills and putting them together in what is sometimes a high pressure situation, right, a performance where you only get one shot, you can't start over, there's no take two, and it's just you and the musicians, and, and, and you do your best to tell a story as if the audience wasn't there. <laughs> 